Greetings everyone, my name is Shiro and I'll be doing the voiceover for today's Rukoi guide. Today we're going to be talking about how you can play Rukoi on your computer and how it gives a huge advantage over mobile. I'd like to thank Forger very much for letting me help with his content. So, first of all, let's get right into our installation of Rukoi overall. In order to play, we're going to need to get an emulator. We're going to be using Nox for our guide here. We simply need to go to bignox.com, which will be in the description of the video. This is the website that you're seeing on screen right now. Then we need to download the installer, which you can do by clicking this big blue and pink button. And after your download is finished, you want to go to your downloads folder and run the setup program. Once you're in the download folder, you're going to want to right click the program you just downloaded and run as an administrator. This is going to open up the installer, which has a big button that says install. You can also hit custom to change the place where your Nox player is going to be installed. You're going to want to hit install. This will take some time depending on your PC itself. And from here, you'll get a button that says start. Simply click it and enjoy the emulator. Once Nox Player is open, it's going to prompt you to log into your Google account. Once you've done that, you want to go into tools, head over to the Play Store. And in the Play Store, search for Root Koi Online. Here you just hit install and you're good to go. Now that we're in the world of Root Koi, let's go over what the benefits of playing on PC are compared to mobile. First off, we have the huge benefit of custom resolution, allowing you to possibly enhance the game's quality over previous experiences you may have had on mobile. Second off, we have hotkeys. This is what gives the Rukoi Online PC players such an upper hand over the mobile players. Being able to heal, move, and special attack all at the same time is very useful for PvP in general, and can normally make the difference for a PC player. To set up our hotkeys, we want to go to the right side of our screen here and click the hotkeys button. There will be many multiple options to choose from, but Rukoi Online only really needs normal single click hotkeys. You're going to want to put the hotkeys over all necessary buttons, such as mana potions, health potions, special attacks, as well as the three classes. After having set up the hotkeys, you can just click whatever they are set as, and the action will happen. Just to build on what Shiro just said, you want your special to be Q, your mana potions to be 1, your health to be 2, and then your melee should be F1. And F2 for your distance, then F3 for your mage. I'd like to thank you all for watching. It was an honor to be able to do a voiceover on Forger's channel. And if you'd like to see or hear more from me, you can find my Twitter and my Twitch down in the description below. I'm an artist and occasional VTubing Twitch streamer. And as always, have a great day, and we hope this guide has helped you enjoy Rukoi even more.